Hi all, welcome back. In this video, we'll be discussing how to set up quotation layout in Odoo 16 sales module. Before setting up our layout, let me show you what the current layout is. So let's open the sales module and create a quotation. So I'm randomly adding a customer. So here is the customer which is Deco. And let's add a product. So I'm adding bacon burger. Okay. Now before confirming it, I am uh, choosing the option which is send by mail. So clicking on that. Okay. So here we have the PDF of the quotation which we created right now. So I'll open it and show the layout. So this is the current layout which is uh, set in the Odoo 16 system. Okay. So here you have the quotation, the description quantity and all of the products. Okay. So I'm just closing it and let's cancel this option, confirm it. And I'll also show the layout of the invoice. So create an invoice here, create a view invoice. Okay. So this is the invoice. I'm confirming it. Okay. So here you have the option which is send and print. Clicking on that. Okay, so let's open and see the invoice layout. How it's set and all. So here's the invoice. As you can see, this is the current layout of the invoice. So now let's go back and set or change different layouts and see how to change the layouts. So first thing what you have to do is go to the settings module. And inside the settings, you have the general settings and under the general settings, if you just scroll down under the company section, you can see document layout. Okay. So here you have the option to configure document layout. Click on that. Okay. So here you have the uh, complete options to change the layout of the documents which you are downloading. Okay, so currently we've uh, chosen the layout as light. So as we've seen the preview of the quotation and the invoice and all, this was the layout which we saw there. Okay, so if you want, you can change it to boxed. So this is the difference. Then you have bold, striped. Okay, so you have four kinds of layouts. So I'm putting it to boxed and here if you want to change the uh, font of the layout or the PDFs or the documents, you can simply change it from here. So here you have the option to change the font. So here you can see the difference. Okay. Okay. Whatever you want, you can choose it from here. Okay. So I'll choose Oswald. Here you have different other fonts as well. Okay. Then here you have the company logo and the colors and all. If you want to change the logo, you can edit it from here and also you have the option to change the colors. So from here, let's choose the color. Okay. I'll choose these two colors. So here you can see the difference. Okay. Let's scroll it. So here's another color you can see. Okay. Then you have the layout background so if you want to keep it blank you can keep it blank if you want to make it geometric so here you can see some uh, shapes and all have come then you have custom so you can add custom files like you can upload file uh, simply choose the pictures and from there opening it so here you can add what pictures as well okay so that's how you set the background of the invoice or the documents. Then you have the company tagline. So if you want to add any taglines and all, you can add it from here. Then you have the company details, the footer and also the paper format. So you have two formats, which is A4 and US letter. Okay. So after this, let's save it. Okay. Now let's go like we have actually changed the layout of the document completely. So whether it's a bill or an invoice, the layout will be different. Uh, so let's go back and see the changes. Go to sales, create a quotation. So here is the quotation. I'm adding a product also. 
okay so here's the product um okay we'll do one thing there's a limit for the customer so i'm changing it to bacon burger itself and let's send by mail so here's the preview let's see so here you can see the layout has changed we've set an image and all in the background and the color and all have changed right okay so that was the uh, quotation uh, you know the pdf of the quotation so now let's see what the changes are inside the invoice so as i said all the documents will take that layout which we set currently so i'm creating the invoice create and view invoice confirm it send and print okay so let's open the invoice pdf okay so here you can see the invoice is also taken the layout which we set right now so every documents that is every documents which we can download and all will take the layout which we currently set inside the general settings of the settings module okay so this is the uh, you know the boxed one which we chose right now so we have other options as well i'll show them also go to the settings here and inside the settings let's open the document layout okay so i'm removing the background image here so currently it's in boxed and here you have the background as geometric and all so let's choose bold again so this is the bold one and if you have chosen striped one then this is the stripe one so we'll put bold okay so layout background i'm changing it to blank if you want you can put it as geometric so we'll put it as geometric itself and here you can change the company details footer and all as we said before saving it okay so after saving i'm going back to sales and we'll see an invoice okay add a customer putting the product here and let's see the change send by mail and here we have the pdf let's open it once it's downloaded so here you can see the layout has changed again okay the geometric that is the background and all have changed the colors changed and all that picture which we put I've, I've removed it so that picture is not visible right now okay so this the same thing will be taken for the invoice as well so this is how you change the layout for the quotation it's a very simple trick that's all for today thank you so much for watching